So today's style is a Christmas style. It's going to be a big braid with a little candy cane. So let's get started. So we're going to start off by creating our candy cane shape. So I've come to the right hand side of the head and I'm just going to move this comb around like that and then straight down by the ear. So trying to make quite sharp lines. And then I'm just going to pin this piece of hair out of the way for now. So I'm just gonna slice this hair across like so. And then we're gonna create another arc shape around. So trying to keep it as even as we can, we're going to create that arc shape. Once you've created that little arc shape inside there, we're going to grab hold of the rest of this hair and just put it out the way for now. And now you're going to braid this little section, this little almost like a horseshoe section of hair. So you're going to break it into three, underneath the middle, underneath the middle, underneath the middle, underneath the middle, and then you're going to start adding in hair. So I'm just going to add in just from the one side. So underneath the middle, nothing added in on that side. I've got lots and lots of tutorials, guys, on how to do these little braids. I will link them in the description. As you can see, we're just creating this little bit of a curve, which is gonna be the beginning of our candy cane. So I'm just not adding in from the right-hand side and just adding in to the left. So you'll keep working this hair all the way around the curve until we get to the straight bit. The tissue, Caitlin. Yes. Yeah. Release this hair down and I'm just going to make a nice little line for myself down here. And that's going to be the line that the braid follows. And again, just kind of put that hair out of my way. And then I'm just going to follow the braid down this line now. So again, just adding in from this left-hand side. And then we're just gonna pop a little elastic at the bottom here. So just put in a little bit of wax here just to make sure it's all nice and neat. I'm just taking my little comb, making sure this is all nice and smooth down. So just gathering all that together there. So coming back to this hair on this side, I've again just used a little bit of wax spray. And then I'm taking my comb and we're gonna do a regular Dutch braid now. So not just taking from one side, we're gonna take from both sides. So under, under, under. And then a little piece of hair from the right gets added in under, a little bit of hair from the left and this will become much easier as we go because it'll get thicker so it won't be quite as fiddly. So just adding in these little baby hairs around the front. Again this braid is going to move around the head so it's going to finish up in the same place as where the little candy cane one is and then we're going to have some fun with that braid because we're going to be putting in some little gems. So I'll show you what I mean by that. So I'm just moving this braid around the heads. And then today guys, I've just decided that I wanted to just, just on this braid, not on the candy cane braid, I just want to tease this out a little bit, just to make it a little bit fuller. So it's not kind of like a really, really tight braid. But you can definitely not do this bit if you don't want to. So just tying that off with a bobble here and then you can just go back in and just tease out this braid as big as you want it. And then I'm just going to take a section of hair and just wrap that around this bobble. You don't have to do this bit, you could just do 
a little scrunchie or a little red bobble if you wanted to. So I've just got some little diamantes here. So we've just got these out of a little craft shop. And I'm just placing them really gently on the hair. If you wanted a little bit more assurance, you could definitely get some like eyelash glue um, and just sort of help these stick down. So you're just going to continue all the way down here. So just pop in the last one on here. And they've all kind of stuck down really, really well. Just coming back to the front here, I think I'm just going to add two more just to give it a little bit more of a curve. So can I have green, please, Caitlin? Caitlin's been amazing. She's been passing me all my little gems. One more green angel. Ooh. We've got gems everywhere, haven't we, Caitlin? Yeah. Doesn't matter. So the last one on here. Pressing that down. And there we have it. Right, so we have the front braid coming across here and then you're turning around until you get to the lovely little candy cane. But I like the fact that we decided to do this extra braid on the side here because I just think it just adds that nice bit of detail to the style. Let me and Caitlin know in the comments what you think and we'll see you again soon.